All right, you guys, so here are the ingredients I have set out. Clearly, I haven't decided absolutely for sure what I want to go in this DIY deep conditioner um, focusing on aloe vera plant, okay? Um, the only reason why I'm debating exactly, because I have so much hair, I want to make sure that I have enough creamy to mix with the gel. Um, so the base is going to be the ORS hair mayonnaise. I love this stuff. This is like a light protein treatment, but I'm still debating whether or not to add Suave's almond and shea butter deep conditioner mask. Honestly, give or take one or two ingredients. This is just like the rinse out conditioner. Um, I will more than likely add just one package to the ORS because I don't want to use all of this also. Um, and then I have several different oils here. I have MCT oil, um, similar to coconut oil, but not really. It stands for medium chain triglycerides, <laughs> MCT. Almond oil, castor oil, and olive oil. You can use any type of oils that you like. And I want to try to get at least, if I could get three fourths of a cup of aloe vera, great. If not, whatever. Um, the stuff I have over here, with the exception of the shampoo, this is going to be for a pre poo. I have a separate video all on that. Okay, so I went ahead and added about three tablespoons of the hair mayonnaise, and I did not add the Suave's um, almond and shea butter hair mask. Instead, I went ahead and added Suave's coconut rinse out conditioner. Kind of struggling to get it out, but yeah. Then I'm gonna go ahead and add the oils. I will be listing the recipe in the description box, okay? Ryan Little. <laughs> How creamy oh my goodness you guys look at how creamy this is look at that so my wash day is until tomorrow but this will be okay until then put the top on hey you guys don't adjust your screens girl don't adjust your screens let this this let this fall come down now I'm standing on my stool <laughs> y'all don't believe me when I'm saying I'm short when I tell you I'm short hold on I'm standing on the stool right this is me not standing on the stool. I just dropped down five feet, like literally five feet. All right, let's get back on the stool. All right, y'all, let me hush it up. Right now, I'm going to be applying this DIY deep conditioner. Now, I went ahead and shampooed my hair. I've been in the shower for like 10 years trying to get the rest of the shampoo out, and I can still feel it on this side. <sighs> I don't know. I don't know what else to say. Um, we're going to go ahead and start applying this DIY deep conditioner. Let's see what the consistency looks like. It's been sitting out at room temperature for about a day. Oh, yeah. Look at that. So creamy. Um, gosh, that's creamy. That's really creamy, y'all. And I'm going to be heavy handed because I have a lot. guys I am done this is what my hair feels like this is up there this is up there for one of the best DIY deep conditioners I've ever used I would definitely be including aloe vera gel if it's available I will be including aloe vera gel in the future in my deep conditioners yes moisture come through 
very nice. So thank y'all so much for watching. Take care.